The Aussie dollar just went full-on bearish, surpassed the lows of the 2008 market crash on Wednesday and dove down to 18-year lows early on Thursday, reaching the levels we talked about two days ago way faster than I thought. Did any of you catch those pips? Welcome to the Tickmill Update. I'm Kenna Danielle, the founder of the Invest Diva movement. Make sure to subscribe to the Tickmill YouTube channel and support us by liking and sharing this video with your Forex trading friends. The corona panic continues to spread all over the markets and the US dollar remains in high demand regardless of the economic data on the calendar. The main reason is the measures and the responses from the central banks and governments to the coronavirus. Investors are taking these measures as clear economic warning that things are really bad. Now are they really that bad? Or are traders simply just panicking because there is a lot of unknown involved? I'd love to hear from you and what you think about this. Today I'm also looking at the dollar Swissy pair which could be one of the only major crosses that is still somewhat within its normal range. It's bounced off from the lower band of the range at 0.92 and is potentially off towards the upper band at around 1.02 in the medium term. Which currency pair have you been trading in the past week? Head over to the comment section and let me know. Of course, trading in the financial markets involves a risk of loss and you should only trade the money that you can afford to lose. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the Tickmill YouTube channel. I'll get back to you with more updates tomorrow.